Hey everyone, it's Sean Smith. I am so excited to teach you guys how to create the Typos Sponsored Products campaign. Uh, this is one of my favorite campaigns. And in terms of ACOS, it performs really well for all of my clients for the most part um, compared to like the proper spellings of the converting term. So these, these campaigns perform really well. They have a low A cost and they generate sales. So let's get started on how to create a sponsored products typos campaign. Awesome. So what I put together here is a dummy uh, search terms report, right? So this is really not th these these customer search terms and keywords and campaign names are all made up. Um, so I just wanted to show you what I do to create typos and create campaigns in sponsored products with, with typos. So let's take a look here. So what I do is I will go on ahead and f use the filter function in Excel and filter them in descending order. for orders placed within one week of a click. So that way I can see which search terms are getting driving the most sales volume. And then I go over to customer search term and I take the top two terms, I copy them, copy them, and then I paste them into this tool. Now this tool is by ppcblog.com. Basically, it generates a list of typos um, and common misspellings that can occur whenever somebody's using their keyboard. And you know, for example, if they're typing and the J is next to the K, they might hit one or the other, um, and they might hit the wrong one, um, or they might miss a letter and search that way. Um, so these do happen. These do occur. Um, I, I can I can tell you from experience with my clients that. Um, we generate sales with them. So this does happen on Amazon. I pick all of them because I want as many typos as possible. Then click generate typos. Click up here and you want to highlight all of them. That can be control A on a PC or command A on a Mac and it doesn't highlight so you just have to hit it and it'll and then copy it and then i'll just open a new sheet here paste them right here sorry my computer for some reason pastes like that let me get rid of that real quick Awesome. So, you know, that, that was just something that happens on my Excel, but normally when you paste, it just pastes like this. So now we have our list of note of typos for the top two converting terms from your search terms reports. What I've been doing is I'll take these, I will start, you know, go to your campaign manager, create, create campaign, and then, um, you know, a manual campaign, dump these keywords, these new typos into a campaign, into their own grad ad group. I name it broad, the ad group. And then I do the match type broad and I'll do a 50 cent default bid. And then I'll see how that performs. If I'm not getting any impressions, then maybe I'll bump it up 10 cents. Um, but you know, if the impressions start rolling in after a couple days, then I'll just kind of let it be and you know see, see what comes of it for the most part though this this campaign type really performs well in terms of a cost and sales it's a great way to generate longer tail keywords um, without having to spend money on keywords and have amazon do the research for you so this is one tactic for keyword research all right guys um thank you so much for listening i really really hope this helped um please let me know if you like this video, if there's something I can do to improve it, or 
also report back with some data on what happens after you use it. Um, it's a great campaign, performs really well. So I, I look forward to hearing from back from you guys. Awesome. Again, this is Sean Smith with Jungle Hustle.